parsnip, which is this beautiful plant that is a part of the carrot family, Apiaceae. And this plant family includes a really broad variety of plants. There's poisonous plants like water hemlock, and then there's our garden variety plants like celery and carrots and parsley that are all a member of the same family. So this particular plant grows out of a really stout tap root that's down on, in the ground, and it gets up to one and a half to two meters tall, so it's really big. So the leaves occur in three segments here. Uh, they're all really broad, they're coarsely toothed, and this is considered palmately lobed. And it has this amazing inflorescence of these beautiful white flowers, and it, these are formed in compound umbels. So you got the big umbel, and then you got the little umbels that are also a part of it. This plant contains a compound called furanocoumarins, uh, and this causes phototoxicity. So if you get the if you get the sap of this plant on your skin and it's exposed to light, then it can cause some bad blistering. So you have to be very careful. But in spite of this characteristic, it was used almost by all of the native groups in the Northwest as a green vegetable. They would pick it when it was really young and they would eat the, the stalks, either of the leaves or of the shoots, and they would peel them very carefully and this helped reduce that uh, poisonous compound. But the, the nutritional value was kind of like celery, and it was mostly eaten fresh, but some tribes would preserve it for uh, winter use by packing it in grease or by drying it. Quileut and maca girls would make baskets for play out of the umbels, and they would weave seaweed in between all of these little rays of this and fill it with shells as a game. Infusions of the flower could be used to make mosquito repellent, which is a super useful thing in my opinion. Now one plant that you have to watch out for that's look-alike is called giant hogweed, and this is an invasive that looks quite a bit like this, but it's enormous. It grows between three to five meters tall, so it's huge, and gardeners thought it would be a really cool thing to put in their gardens, but it turns out this plant, giant hogweed, uh, creates violent third-degree burns if you touch its sap. So you really have to watch out for it. Cities do their best to kill it whenever they find it. But uh, we like the little one here, the, the native beautiful cow parsnip. Uh, so it's a really wonderful plant and also nature's bug repellent.